Good morning. It is Wednesday, August 4th, 2021. So I was just reading uh, an article catching up on my reading um, in Christian Century, a magazine that I've uh, subscribed to as long as I can remember. Um, there was an, an article in there written by uh, someone who uh, teaches at a uh, seminary in Chicago, and he asked this question, and it got me thinking. Do you serve God, or do you serve the church? Do you serve God, or do you serve the church? And then he took it one step further. Do you love God, or do you love the church? Do you love God and serve God, or do you love the church and serve the church? Two things that can be very different. So I got out the service for ordination to remind me um, that I am called to serve and to love God. And I am called to serve in the church on behalf of the one whom I love in answer to the call that I believe I have received through that church. And so when we are ordained, we are asked, will you serve Christ? Will you love Christ? Will you proclaim Christ? Will you be God's messenger to all the people of God that you encounter? Will you serve them with the gospel of hope and salvation? Never once is it mentioned about a particular congregation. Never once is it mentioned the congregation you grew up in or even where you are going to serve. We are called to serve Christ through the church, to love Christ through the church. Now, those two things can work together. I certainly learned about Christ. I learned about God through the church. It wouldn't have happened any other way uh, for me. That's how it happened. And so those two can be connected in a healthy and in a good way. But sometimes if we focus on the church and our love on the church, then we can, and this was the writer's uh, caution, we can forget about God and about serving Christ and loving God and loving Christ. I try to never say, and I try to catch myself even if I do say it, that I am not, um, it is not my church. I don't say uh, Trinity Lutheran Church is my church, you know, as I hear uh, many of my colleagues say. I say I serve at Trinity Lutheran Church because to me that's a difference. It's not my church. It's not your church, it's Christ's church, and we serve there. We have the opportunity to love through this place and through the ministries that are done and accomplished here. So I want you to consider that too, as I am still processing this in my mind. Do you love God or do you love the church? Do you serve Christ or do you serve the church? And what does that mean for you? And I'd be interested to hear your reflections. Let's pray. God, we give you thanks. We give you thanks for your church that ought to always lead us to you, that we are called to serve you through the church, to love you through the church. Help us never to get the two confused, never to get them mixed up, but that always remember that we are called to love and serve you. And it happens sometimes through the local church, but sometimes it happens through things that we do at work or things that we do at home or things that we do in the community or in the neighborhood or at the ball field or wherever it is we might find ourselves. But help us always to be strengthened by your love and your grace and your encouragement. And it is through Christ's holy and precious name we pray. Amen. God bless. See you tomorrow.